everybody, today I'm going to be doing a current favorites video and I haven't done one of these since my winter favorites and I know it's not spring yet but I just want to do like a current favorites. I feel like there's a lot of products I haven't updated you guys on so let's go ahead and jump right into it because I have a ton of stuff. But first, if you guys haven't noticed, I do have a new setup. I finally got Studio Softbox Light so if you notice a difference, if you like this lighting, definitely give this video a thumbs up or let me know your thoughts in the comments as far as the setup. I would love to hear you guys' opinion because I wanted to invest in some nice lights that way I could have more professional quality videos for you guys. So I think I'm good to go for now. Another thing really quick, I do want to have a giveaway on my Twitter. I just want to give back to you guys and I'm going to be hosting it over on my Twitter page. So if you're not following me on that, it's just a glam me up. I always have the link in the description box below. So follow me on there and on Instagram. So if there's anything that you guys have been dying to get, definitely let me know because I would love to get something just to give back to you guys. So leave me a comment down below what kind of prizes you want to win and don't forget to follow me over on Twitter to see when that is going to be going on. So I guess let's go ahead and just start off with hair care because you guys have been asking me so much what's been going on with my hair since you guys have noticed the difference. It has a lot more body and the curls are a lot more defined so let's just go ahead and get into that. I've been trying out the Nuance hair products. You guys know I did a full brand review on the makeup but this is just a few of the hair products that I've been loving from then. I have a bunch more to show you guys but I'm still trying to experiment with them and figure out what's the best combination and the order to use them in for my hair. Um, so I will be doing another hair care video as soon as I figure that out. But my favorites so far have been the Wave Enhancing Styling Swirl. This is similar to the one I used to use from L'Oreal, which I still love that one as well, but it was a little bit heavy for my hair. This one is very lightweight. If you have wavy hair or if your curls are not as tightly defined, I definitely recommend this. It's definitely not a really strong hold. None of these products have been for me so far, but it does give my hair more body and a lot more curl definition. But Throughout the end of the day, I notice I do get a little bit of frizz, so they're not as strong hold as I'm used to, but I'm still trying to play with them and figure it out. Um, this is the Blue Agave Curl Cream, and this works awesome at defining my curls. I just used this today, and I just used a little bit of this on top, and it gave me pretty much the majority of the curl definition that I have. I've also really been liking the Intense Hydration Hair Mask. This is like a huge bottle. It's going to take me forever to get through it. But I love using this deep conditioning treatment in the shower once a week. You can even use it more than that if you want. It's just super hydrating and nice. And I love all the Nuance products because they're cruelty free and they're natural as well. And they're designed to use with sulfate free shampoo and conditioner because they don't contain any parabens or anything like that. So I love them so much and they've been working wonders for my hair as you guys have noticed. So now just some skincare products I've been loving. This is the Million Dollar Tan Cabana Tan Extreme Sunless Tanning Lotion. I have been self tanning again. I've tried this out about two times now and I can already say I really like it. Although I wish the color payoff was a little bit better. That's all I'm going to say about it so far. I think it's extremely natural though. I will have a full review on this self tanning lotion very soon. But so far I think the color payoff is probably medium. It's not as dark as the Sun Goddess one that I love. Um, but it is definitely buildable. You can build it up and get a fuller coverage. But I just like how it's a white lotion so it doesn't rub off on your sheets or anything. The color is very natural as well and it's not too orangey or anything. So I've been loving this so far. I will give you guys an update video, like a full review and demonstration on the um, Million Dollar Tan. So then I just have the L'Oreal Youth Code products. You guys might have seen these products in my nighttime routine video. If you haven't seen that, I'll link it for you all down below. But these are texture perfecting products, so they're supposed to even out your skin tone and they're supposed to help correct dark spots and age spots and freckles and just give your skin a more even texture. And that's definitely something I'm trying to work towards. So this is the serum and then this is the thick day or night cream. I only use this at night though and I've been using the serum night and day underneath of my moisturizer. So far I've been loving them. I've been tracking my progress with them. I have seen a difference in my skin as far as the acne, the leftover acne marks, but I've been doing a lot of different things so I'm not sure exactly what it's from, but I definitely have been loving those products so far. Now let's finally get into makeup. The first thing I wanted to talk about is my Lorac Pro palette. I have been obsessed with this so much. I love it. I love it because it has a full um, row here of shimmery colors and then it has all matte colors at the top. I do want to do a fully matte makeup look, maybe like a bridal look or even like makeup for wrinkles. I'm still going to be doing that video because that's perfect for matte eyeshadows for that. And I just love the versatility with this and the colors look amazing on brown eyes. I've been obsessed with that. Another kind of dupe for that too is the NYX Love and Florence palette. This one has some very similar shades that are in that palette. And I talked about this in another tutorial that I did. But I just love these NYX eyeshadow quads. You can find these at Target, I think. But this one has five gorgeous shimmery shades. I love the champagne color here. I just think it's so shimmery and very pretty. And they're super like foil looking so they have extreme shimmer and this one is in the shade 
Sunsets with Sophia, and it's the Love and Florence one. I'm kind of going in random order here, but I also have the NYX BB Cream. I've been using this a lot lately. I think it's amazing BB Cream. I do have a full review on this if you guys want to check it out. That was actually my last video I posted, so that's going to be linked in the description box below. But I think this is a really good medium coverage BB Cream. It just makes your skin look very natural, and I think it is great quality. So definitely check that out if you're trying to find a new BB Cream or a tinted moisturizer. And along with foundation, I've been using my Beauty Blender a ton lately. Speak Now 17 or Nicole was nice enough to give this to me for Christmas. And I just love it because my foundation goes on so smooth and just looks amazing and airbrushed. And it's not too cakey or anything. It's just perfect for doing concealer under the eyes or foundation. It just looks flawless and it's not like too much going on. It's very lightweight coverage and I love that. So then I just have some eye products here. The first one is the Nuance, again, available at CVS. This is their Natural Look Brow Pencil. I showed this in my all-time favorites, and I've been using it a lot in videos lately. It's just amazing on your eyebrows. I'm wearing it today. My eyebrows just look very natural looking to me. I feel like they're not too heavy or too thick or anything. And I've never been a fan of pencil eyeliners, but this one has just really changed it for me to where I don't even need to use the powder or anything. And then it has a little spoolie on the other end as well, which just makes it perfect. Definitely check that out at CVS if you have it. Then I just have the CoverGirl Bombshell Eyeliner. I love this eyeliner. I tried the CoverGirl um, liquid liner before, but this one is just different. This is the Bombshell one. It stays on so well. It's kind of hard to even remove when I remove my makeup at night because it just stays put. So I love the short little handle that it has because it makes it so easy and you can just glide it on really fast and it takes like hardly any time in the morning. And it's just super black and it doesn't rub off when I curl my lashes. So I've been loving that one. Then I just have two lip products here, and what do you know, they're the NYX Butter Lipsticks that everyone's been talking about. I love these. I have one in fun size, and then I also got a new shade here in Candy Buttons, which is a pretty pinky coral shade. I definitely want to get more of these. I want to get some brighter colors and stuff for the springtime and maybe some more berry colors, but these two have definitely been my favorites. They're very natural and very wearable because they're somewhat sheer, but you can build up the coverage of them, and then I like how this one is like a nice little subtle pop of color. Then I have two nail polishes that I'm kind of rediscovering. I might have shown these in a favorites video a while back. I don't even remember when I got these. It might have been in the summer. I think it was in the summer. But these are the Sinful Colors Sinful Shine with Gel Tech. I don't think you can find these in the store, but you can find them on Walgreens website. And they're only $1.99 a piece. But the first one is the one I'm wearing on my nails right now. This is the color Spitfire, and it's just a gorgeous purple shade. These are perfect for spring or summertime, and I love how long wearing these are. I've always thought that Sinful nail polishes didn't last as long. I found that they chipped easier, but these stay on so well. It says they have gel technology in them, and they really do stay put for so long, and I just love the gorgeous shades. The formulation is amazing. And then I have one in Rendezvous, which is a really pretty minty blue color, and this is amazing. This is very similar to For Audrey by China Glaze, which is like the infamous Tiffany blue color. Um, I just think it's gorgeous. So I also wanted to share with you guys a new website that I've been obsessed with lately, and that is called Louvrocracy. And I recently made an account, and I actually have it listed in the description box below. It's just louvrocracy.com slash glammyup. And on here, people post different products, things that they're loving, and it has links to where you can purchase them. So as you can see, as an example here, someone posted a makeup organizer, and it will search for you the cheapest place that you can buy it. So you don't have to worry about looking all around on the internet trying to find the cheapest place. If you just see a picture of something and you want to know where to buy it, this is a great website for that. Um, and then you can order off of here. So you place the order through here and then they order it for you from the website that has it at the cheapest price. So they find you the price and whatever they have the cheapest price is when your order will be placed. They do all the shipping and everything. Um, so your order is going to come from Lubocracy. So it's just awesome. You can shop for so many different things on here. They have makeup and fashion, just anything that you want. And it's also nice because you can browse it by category or you can also browse it by price. And if you click the little plus sign up here, that's where you can make a new collection. You can love a product. You can get suggestions for stuff. Um, for example, if you wanted to type in NYX Butter Lipsticks and search, and it will find the product for you, and then it will find the cheapest price of where you want to buy it. So here is my Lubocracy page that I created. As you can see on your profile, you'll have collections, and I've actually created a collection to go along with this video. So if you're interested in buying any of the products that I mentioned in this video, I made a whole collection dedicated only to those. A lot of them, they've already found the cheapest price, which is awesome, especially for stuff that's hard to find, like these Sinful Shine nail polishes. I couldn't find them anywhere online where they were still sold, so they've already found the cheapest price for you guys, so you can order them through there. 
Um, and you also get $10 off your first order when you order through Livocracy. As long as your order is more than 20 bucks, then you'll get $10 off. So you can purchase any of the items that I talked about. You can look for your own items. So all you have to do is make a Livocracy account to be able to get that deal. So I'll have the link below for my Livocracy page if you guys want to follow me. If you want to follow me, just hit the trust button and that just means that you trust my recommendations. And if you want to create your own page and love different items, then you can refer them to your friends and stuff. And if they purchase items through your recommendations, then you earn rewards from that as well. And Livocracy also has an iPhone and an Android app. So if you guys want to download the apps for your cell phones, you can easily shop on there and browse. And I'll have the link to where you can download those in the description box below. That is all my products that I have been loving recently. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Like I said, I am going to have a giveaway coming up on there. And let me know what prizes you want to win in the comments down below. I also wanted to see if you guys could please leave me any questions that you have for me in the comments down below. I'm going to be doing a question and answers video. So you can ask me anything you want, whether if it's about makeup, hair, just life advice, college advice, anything you want to know, leave it for me in the comments down below it. I will refer back to this video. I'll shout out your name and everything too in the video, but I am going to be doing another frequently asked questions video. So leave any questions and concerns and stuff that you have in the comments below. And I post videos every Wednesday and Saturday, so don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on one if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye everyone.